For all you 10 scale racers out there, this is the Nitride Sensored Brushless ESC. And it has some pretty cool features we've never seen before on any ESCs. Most obviously, the big old LCD display on the top and all that it can do, which we'll talk more about in a minute. But have you noticed there's no cooling fans? The nitride is made using an aluminum nitride ceramic cooler to handle all its thermal needs, hence its name. And the cooler is placed at the bottom of the ESC. Out of the box, the ESC includes this mounting plate to screw onto the bottom of the ESC, and then you'll sticky tape this plate to the chassis. That way the fins have full clearance and they don't get gummed up by tape. And that will cool the ESC down for any 2S LiPo use down to four and a half turn motors. Now the screen. This is a TFT LCD with a resolution of 160 by 80 pixels. And this is what the home screen looks like, providing some of our current information like battery voltage and motor and ESC temperature, and that we're in blinky mode. Now, if you hit the right button that says data, it'll go into our voltage and temperature minimum and maximums recorded since the unit was powered on. Pressing the right button again goes into the graphs with the ESC temps first and hitting the center button scrolls next to motor temp and then the battery voltage and finally your throttle use. And now we've just looped back to the first graph. Hitting the right button from here goes into histograms with RPM first then full throttle, full acceleration, and back to RPM. Now with the ESC programming, as you imagine, you do it all right on the unit using the screen, and you engage programming mode by holding down the left and right buttons together. And it jumps first into throttle programming, scroll again to brakes, then reverse, motor boost, motor turbo, the hull angle adjustment, a maintenance log, your protection settings, ESC calibration, and lastly, the profile. The nitride does even more than that, but you get the idea. It's a pretty slick little unit with 180 amps continuous current, a full aluminum case, and it's about the same size and weight as other competitive 2S ESCs, although it may be actually a little bit shorter. It's definitely a unique approach to ESCs, and it's especially convenient and quick for any ESC programming and ESC calibrations. Plus, it's kind of like a luxury to have all this data logging information to review after your race. So, pretty cool ESC, now available at A-Bain Hobbies. Go check it out, guys.